Hello and welcome back. Today we've got Code Artifact, which is another AWS service for developers. So here's an example of uh, code dependencies. When we write code or when developers write code and create uh, complex systems, often it's not just all in one file. There's lots of different files and lots of different um, elements to a uh, program libraries and packages um, and other sorts of dependencies where uh, their code depends on these things. And that's what Code Artifact is for. It's uh, designed to help store uh, these uh, packages and uh, libraries and so on so that you can or developers can effectively use them and they can be referenced in code. So remember our diagram from before when we were talking about code commit uh, and code build and then code deploy and um, deploying that to EC2 or another, some other destination and how all of that is part of code pipeline. So that's what we've covered in the previous tutorial. Um, and where does Code Artifact fit in here? Well, Code Artifact fits in over here. So developers can access Code Artifact to see what dependencies they already have stored there and that they can use in their new code or reference in the new code. And also it works directly with code build so that the new code actually can uh, use these artifacts. So in the exam, whenever you see artifact management, uh, cost-effective package management service, uh, storing code dependencies, think about code artifact. So there we go. Here's a quick summary of what we discussed and I look forward to seeing you back here next time. Until then, enjoy the cloud.